درناوی دنکو د ناتو د غوندی او د افغانستان په موضوع په ناتو کې د امریکا په خوانې سفیر کورت واکر راسره دی کاغلی واکر نن سبا د جانز هاپکنز په پاینتون کې استاد او د اټلانټیک شورا مشر سلاکار دی کاغلی واکر دیر من از مک پخپروانه کی مو گډون وکړ پوښته نه بدا وکړه چې د افغانستان څخه د ناتو د ځواکونو وتل د جمهور رئیس اوباما او د جمهور رئیس کرزي د دوه په سیاسي ګټه تمامیږي د افغانستان د ولس لپاره د څه پایلې درلودلې I think that the Afghan people need to have security, they need to have respect for their human rights, they need to have economic opportunities, that's what they need. Right now you have a situation where the Taliban is trying to attack Afghanistan to the rule, creating a tremendous sense of insecurity, and I don't think that it's possible for the Afghan government alone to provide that kind of security to the Afghan people yet. So I think that we need to see a continued international commitment to support Afghanistan. Now, the balance of that, how much international support, how much Afghan leadership, there is a lot of room to work. And ultimately, of course, we want to see no international presence. We'd love to see Afghanistan stand on its own. But we've got a long ways to go before it's able to get there. You have to force to leave the country. Do you believe the Taliban and other insurgent groups will be more likely to stop peace and pursue their agendas through the political process? Right, no, I don't believe that for one minute. I think that the Taliban has used force very aggressively against the Afghan people, against the Afghan government. And now they see that there's an opportunity ahead. They think that we're all leaving. They think they can reimpose the rule, and they're just going to keep pressing ahead. So I don't see negotiations from the Taliban side. What I hope we can do after this Chicago summit that we just had uh, is to get away from this talk of deadlines and withdrawals and instead start talking again about what we need to achieve in Afghanistan for the Afghan people and to talk about a long-term commitment to get there. ترجمة If we have that, and if it is extended over a long period of time, that is something, again, that the actors in South Asia, whether it's the Taliban or the Haqqani network or the Pakistani government, everyone will have to adjust to that reality of a long-term commitment to Afghanistan. Until now, they've adjusted to the sense that we're withdrawing in 2014. Now we have a chance to actually play that out in a longer period. یعنی وروستی پخته نداده تی تاسیل اقتصادی هوا این چه دقت کل مبغاری دستی دستی است که دیت متوجه نیست راه کل کی تو فکر نمایی یا موفقت نمایی تنگ کی افغانستان تو جواب کل پایتی کرد. یو بله نظر چه اکثریت خلقی داری افغانستان کی دپر مختاج لپار د تعلیم و تربیه د خلق و تدریسگار او دیو غختلی حکومت جوره ول وی چه افغانستان دپار اساسی تکیه د وسیلی حکومت پدرو I guess I would say yes, there has been progress, but not enough. I think if you go back and you look 10 years, you can say, okay, we have now 7 million kids in school as opposed to only a few hundred thousand. You have much greater respect for women's rights than you had back in 2001. You have a higher level of economic development than you had in 2001. So you can measure progress. On the other hand, I don't think it's enough progress. I think the Afghan people are very concerned about corruption, about the effectiveness of government. And of course, they're still concerned about the security, and that's what the Taliban feeds on. Is they're trying to, to create insecurity and a lack of confidence in Afghanistan. That's why we need to continue to try to support this kind of development that you talked about for the long term. In Afghanistan, that's succeeding is one that the people will believe in, and one where the Taliban will not be able to make further inroads. دیر منانه اندکه وسیتی که باندی با مگه دنن استاسی نظر می‌آید. شما منانه او کو کرمودان.